Hi guys, it's Gina. Just going to do a little quick haul of me shopping at Costco today. Um, trying to get my house set up for keto. Don't really know how far I got, but I'm just going to show you what I got at Costco. Okay. It makes my house look like a disaster, so I'm not real crazy about that. But, here we go. Um, okay, so I got a garden salad. I don't know how much I'm actually going to eat this, but this is the kind of salad my husband likes. I had me a package of the um, organic lettuce, but when I got up to the register at Costco, I saw kind of a sliminess of it, so I made him take it back. So I'll, I have to go to Safeway anyways, so, or maybe a different store. I, I might try out another one called Sprouts where I live, which is more locally grown, I believe. But anyways, so I got that. I got me some artichokes, just some dull artichokes. I also got this, which um, we love anyways. It's uh, artichoke jalapeno dip and spread. So I wasn't really sure how much I was going to be able to eat it, but it has one carb and zero sugars. And the fat is an eight. So, you know, I don't know. I'm going to try it, see what it does for me. Um, probably eat it with celery sticks. Normally, of course, I would eat it with like Stacy's chips or something. Um, I got a new cheese that I tried to get um, organic, you know, where I could and um, grass fed type things. Um, so I got this Sierra Nevada cheese, garlic herb Sierra Jack cheese, just for like, um, just for like a little snack cheese. Um, it was only five bucks, five and a half. So we'll try that. Got pickles. You can't live without pickles because hello, we can have them. Got some Kerrygold butter. Um, it's the only kind I saw there that seemed like it might be better for us because it was with the grass fed. Um, cows and a little bit healthier. I didn't get, now they had a cheese that was Kerrygold, but it did not say what it was. And from everything I've read and heard, the sharp cheeses are a little bit better for us than like the creamy cheeses. So um, I went ahead and got the Tillamook. I didn't get the Kerrygold cheese only because it didn't really explain it. Okay, so I got some um, organic trimmed green beans. I'm going to make those with some bacon and onion, just like your grandma used to do, I'm sure, back in the day. Um, let them cook for like an hour on the cooktop in some butter and water. Perfect. Okay, so I got these packaged carnitas. Now let me just tell you, I never buy things like this. Pre-packaged things just doesn't sound like something I'm normally interested in because I like to cook. I like to make them myself. But they have no carbs and no sugars. 200 calories a serving for each three ounce serving. So I thought I would try them. Now we are both still taking Omez, I don't even know how to say that. Omez, I don't even know how to say it, but it's a heartburn pill. Tom and I both take it. Got some broccoli, got some baby spinach, got the coffee creamer back there. I'm sorry folks, I'm not gonna live without it. I started making it with um, heavy cream, and that was worse. I mean, there's hardly nothing in this Coffee Mate, and it just works for me. I'm gonna use it. It doesn't have any sugar in it. Um, I don't know if you wanna see. It has uh, one carb and no sugars. So I'm not giving that up. Um, I got Philadelphia cream cheese for my husband because he eats a bagel every single morning with uh, cream cheese on it. However, I'm not really sure that I'm going to pick this one because it does have two carbs in it. So I might try to pick me out something else. Got sour cream. Sour cream has one carb and one sugar um, that we just always have in the house. We, we just always have it. Got some hamburger meat. Just got regular Costco hamburger meat. Um... Just because, oh my lands, there, and I might pick me some up, but there at Costco, their um, grass-fed meat was like this size and double the money. And so I think I might go to a local farm here, a uh, cow, I don't even know what you call them, but slaughter place where the, you get local meat. 
and see about that. And then I went ahead and got this because it said no nitrates um, and I love peppered turkey. That's my favorite. Um, and, it had, and it said re reduce sodium so that's always better for us because we don't need all that salt that we always have. Um, but it had also um, one carb and one sugar. So I'm not real crazy about it having the sugar in it but um, I'll see how that works out. And I can't really stand that my kitchen is looking like this. So I'm going to have to go clean my kitchen up because it's driving me crazy. <laughs> but that's what I bought today at Costco. And um, I'm really new at this. I'm going to try to get everything. See, I don't really eat sugars anyway, so sweetie kind of stuff. I mean, I think there's some popsicles in my freezer. I don't care nothing about that kind of stuff. Not one thing. It'll probably sit there for the next six months. Now, I'll tell you one thing. I had some some uh, old Hershey cocoa in here in my house. I took some heavy cream one day, whipped it up like whipped cream because heavy whipping cream, um, put some cream cheese in it, about a tablespoon of cream cheese, and it was this, and a little bit of that cocoa, and a um, equal, I think there's an equal packet laying on the counter over there, and an equal packet. It was yummy, yummy. And it got fat in. It didn't have any carb. Well, it had the two carbs from the Philadelphia. So it had two carbs, and it had a high fat content, and didn't have any sugars in it. And I needed to get my fat up, so that's what I did, and it was really good. It was really, really, really good. And then yesterday, I made something similar, except instead of putting cocoa in it, I don't know if you can see my bullet here, um, instead of putting cocoa in it I just put a little bit of vanilla and it's it's like a a little sweet whipped cream it's working I mean I just pull me out a tablespoon or spoon uh, a tablespoon or two of it and um and eat it if I need to get my fat up if I need to get in the right right ratios because I'm having some trouble with the fats I'm just being honest having trouble with the fats so but anyways I'm talking I'm not on camera I'm sorry I don't know if I can come around here now so I know I look like a mess, but um, hope you enjoyed it. I know you guys are crazy about hauls. It's weird. I don't know why you guys like them, but they seem to get the most views on everybody's channels. So there I went. Um, I am going to do a Tag Me Tuesday tomorrow, so look for that. And my way in Wednesday. See you guys later. Love you. Bye.